knock on what our our, our suppliers um, we have constant communication with our suppliers and I, I do believe that's that's integral to um, our business because it is a commodity um, our, our our suppliers have ensured us that we're it's it's going to be tight but um, um, given the geopolitical issues and, and whatnot so um, it's it's going to be challenging it's not going to get any easier but uh, so far I think we'll be okay we're very fortunate. We're close to the Hattiesburg storage facility, so we uh, we have that to utilize. We also have uh, supply points at Greenville and Memphis as well, so we utilize all three to, to take care of our needs there. Uh, all our bulk tanks are monitored, so we stay on top of those and keep them full, and when the monitors say we can hold a load of gas, we bring them in. And uh, we try uh, to keep most of our customers are either forecasted or they have monitors as well. And so we, we take advantage of um, opportunities and efficiencies where we can to keep them supplied. The uh, current state of the propane industry, we're seeing a lot of uh, new construction growth in our area, uh, the Dallas-Fort Worth area. Um, we, uh, we have concerns over the uh, propane builds uh, coming up for the uh, heating season and the crop drying season um, and uh, what our uh, propane inventories are going to look like going into our heating season. Yeah, the state of the propane supply I think has me concerned along with a lot of others. We do not want another 2014 experience with the cold and what we had. So I think a lot of us are really working on what can nullify this and reduce it? And to me, it always went back to relationships, relationships with my supplier, relationships with the infrastructure and transportation. We have also purchased our own trucks to haul the product so that we don't have to rely on anyone else. But the relationship with the supplier and being able to sit down and say, we need this many gallons, make sure we have it. And I think a lot of people this year have adopted that just so they can secure their gallons for their residential customers. We've also taken another approach of trying to supply the propane to the tanks earlier. So coming out in the summer and using that gas to fill and trying to alleviate so much of the demand that's in the winter.